Well, good morning, everyone. It is Vlogmas Day 24, which means it is also Christmas Eve. <laughs> oh my gosh, this Vlogmas has flown by. They always do, but this one especially just feels like it went by in a blink. Feels like I was just finishing Halloween Horror Nights, and now here we are. It's Christmas Eve, which means it's the final day for the Advent calendars. We've got our first round of Christmas today because Santa came overnight. There's quite a bit of stuff under our tree that was not there yesterday and my parents' stockings are full. So Santa stopped by last night, we went to bed, he came by, delivered quite a few items for us. So we've got that, we're gonna have a Christmas Eve midday meal, fancy Christmas Eve midday meal, not really fancy, but just a Christmas Eve celebration and it's gonna be a good day. My parents are out in the living room right now watching my vlog from yesterday. <laughs> so I'm hiding in here until they finish it and then I'll go to the Advents and we'll kick off Christmas Eve. I cannot, cannot believe it. It's wild. <laughs> I also did my nails last night. I feel like they very much fit with the tree. Very much the mid-century modern stars that I love so much. I'm gonna wait on the advents until a little later because my mom has started making the mac and cheese and while the food's cooking, we're gonna be doing some present opening. So we'll come back to the advents this afternoon. I know that's out of order, but it's also the last day of the advent, so I really wanna savor that final moment of like opening my final things and the advent's being done. So I'm gonna put it off. I'm gonna procrastinate. Look at that. Santa has been here. Very exciting. The tree's not empty. I mean, it was never empty. It just had decoy presents. <laughs> right, Bean? What did... You gotta wait till tomorrow. Santa Claus comes tomorrow. Sorry. He only comes once a year. You gotta be good. You gotta be good for a whole other day. One more whole day of being good. You seem skeptical. <laughs> Can you be good for one more whole day? One more whole day of being good. Being a good little boy. Another time. Yep, it's right over here. We got the, the mac and cheese is starting over here. Yep, we're making the white sauce. Yep, making the homemade mac and cheese. It's in progress. Salt because the cheese is salty. Can we just add a bunch of salt ourselves at the end? Yeah. <laughs> the cheese is salty. You can use the, yeah. You might have to open the other one. There's not much left in there. Probably enough. Maybe I'll use this up. I don't feel overboard with this. Either. How are these marinated? Is this what's in them? Pepper? Uh, no, that's just like a olive oil. Okay. Mm -hmm. This is going to make like a gravy. Because it's got butter and flour. A roux. Butter, flour, roux. And it's always one to one. So if you're making three cups of sauce, you use three tablespoons of butter, three tablespoons of flour. There you go. If you're making one cup, you use one, one, one. Two cups is two, two, two. Easy this to remember. Is, this is the part we have to watch out for it to not burn not the milk. Burn. Yep. Let's all that milk in it. Are you learning how to? <laughs> He's so attentive. Mm -hmm. He's like, this is great, great lesson, Grandma. Tell me all about it. And sometimes I use a whisk. I have to say that he never does this when I'm cooking. Ash never stays in the kitchen. Mm -mm. He might stay on the other side of the island, but he never stays this close. He's watching you. He's making yeah. sure. He's keeping his eye on Grandma. Yeah. That's so funny. I don't care about that other lady. She's just, <laughs> she's just food lady to me. She came in, tried to okay. steal attention from my dad. See what it's starting to do now? It's starting to bubble and get foamy. Yes. Then I take it off. She started adding blocks of cheese. It's I got cheddar cheese. It, but you could have it grated, it would melt sooner. Mm -hmm. Cooked macaroni that I drained. Two cups. Two cups of uncooked. And then I don't know what it is now, but it was two cups uncooked. So that's all been drained and cooled down a little bit. Ouch. Yeah, that that's gonna be hot. hot. <laughs> that end is hot. The delicious sauce inside. Right. Stir all that up. A little 
little soupy, it won't matter. Yeah, because the pasta's gonna absorb mm -hmm. a good amount of that sauce while it bakes. And you want a lot of sauce. Did you grease it? You can do if you want. You want me to? I mean, that's up to you. You know the recipe. You can. It it washes out it, okay. easy. Then I'm fine. As soon as you, if you're ready I to trust you. If you're ready to soak, willing to soak the pan a little bit afterwards, it washes out. That Ash is very interested. And you got to do freshly grated. You can't do the bag stuff. It doesn't melt the same. Well, I agree with you. It's got that flour stuff on yeah, it. Yeah, that's why it doesn't melt the same because it's got the flour to preserve it. It just doesn't. It keeps it from sticking together in yeah. the bag. Yeah. Anytime you're doing something like this, you need the you need the fresh grated. And you're gonna pop it in the oven, probably 350. It may take 30, 30, 40 minutes, whatever, when it's nice and brown and everything's melted. Foster's all about, where did you Foster's, go? yeah, Foster's like, I will do any cleanup, any cleanup you need. I am here at your service. Are you guys all interested? We're on the floor. This is for the puppies. Hmm. Oh, what is this? Oh. Hmm? Colby's the most likely, but they've never opened presents. I yeah, I don't think. I mean, like he won't. Worry. No, Rory knew how to open she, presents. She ripped them apart. Yeah. We, we taught her that first year that she could open. We started with tissue paper and just encouraged her. And yeah, then I don't think I'm encouraging shredding of anything. No, not with this one, no. But yeah, we, we started with tissue paper and encouraged her. Or let your daddy open it. So the next year she got it. Can you get daddy open it? Can He's like, there is something in here. Oh! Now that daddy's got it. He's looking at it. Get it, get it, get it, Colby. Get it, Colby. He's like, <laughs> oh, now it's slimy. <laughs> <laughs> that makes it better. <laughs> We're gonna reuse this paper. <laughs> <laughs> it must be treats. Does it smell good? <laughs> What's in there, Colby? What's in there, bub? Oh, did you know it was for you? <gasps> Look, oh, Colby's like, my nose works. I know this is for me. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> oh, I guess everybody wants one, huh? You want a Christmas treat? Do you want a Christmas treat? Here, Colby. Col oh, yep, the bag is, oh, oh boy. <laughs> Oh, oh boy. Wait a minute. I can't open it. Colby, sit. Ash. Good boy. Ash. As close as he can get. You want to smell? Oh, oh. Colby, sit. I know. I don't. Oh, good. Give me your paw. Thank you. <laughs> hi, Grandma. Oh, grandma. hi, Grandma. Oh, good. You want to sit? Oh. <laughs> How many paws can I give you before you give me something? Right. Colby, you're a little close. He's very close. <laughs> there you go. Oh. <laughs> yes. Oh, Merry take Christmas, boys. Right All right. Now, Dad's going to take that into the kitchen so that they're not. Yeah, she's going to Dad. Oh, God. Well, where'd it go? Oh, no. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? He's just still got the top part Colby, of the bag. Colby, are you looking guilty as heck right now? I know I'm not supposed to have this. <laughs> you guys still be good today. But Santa Claus still, still has to come. Just random. They don't. <laughs> the Japanese gummies. Mm -hmm. Used to get those at Epcot. They're so good. They're the lychee flavor. They're my favorite. Okay, like the lychee fruit. Mm-hmm. All right. I don't think I've ever had them. Ash, excuse me, <laughs> trying to vlog here. <laughs> He's like, I'm just, he just, just kicked her foot. Uh, he did what? He kicked he your foot. Kicked he your did foot. your, he did the tap of your foot. Like, all right, rub nope. me. Oh. <laughs> he likes to have his chest <laughs> rubbed. Pickle, <laughs> pickle gummies. Inside your ornament. Yep. <laughs> Adding to the pickle collection. <laughs> this is all my, always my favorite paper. Isn't that cute? The best paper. There's Bumble. Because you're a little scavenger. You now you can't get to it. Is there a theme here? <laughs> <laughs> yes. 
dad's not into the sweet stuff, so I gotta find the savory. He likes gummies, but he's not into all the chocolates and stuff, so I had to find... Are these gummies too? No, those are actual pickles. I was gonna say. Those are real pickles. Yeah. Sucker punch classic. <laughs> well, thank you. Mm-hmm. Pucker up. Well, I hope you like that. It's already ground, so now no, you don't like, have to make I, a lot of noise. I know I like that one. Yeah, that's that's morning safe. Can I eat this? Safe. Colby's on the prowl. Make it in the morning. It's morning safe. Colby's like, excuse me, why was only one gift from me? Excuse me? Where's all the rest of my gifts? <laughs> excuse me? Santa Paws is coming tomorrow, Bear. It's a really big tumble room. <laughs> loves a good tennis ball shred. What is it? Hey, Colby. Colby. <gasps> Ash. Ash. <gasps> yes. oh, they don't want the one he's got. Foster. Colby is out. Ash. I know they won't last long, but... <laughs> We decoyed you, but yeah. bringing them to us. Oh, yeah. oh. We took his up in the. I shall take this. And save and these it. don't have squeaks. So. There goes Foster. Foster, you don't have to go in the bedroom with it. Yeah. He hoarded it. All right, let's all be behave now. Lay down. I think we're okay. okay. Yeah, I'm watching okay. Colby. He's like, wait, wait, what does he have? Wait, his is different. I want his. Where'd that other one go? Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Ashes there was something else in there for you. <laughs> this is great, Grandma. Thank you, Grandma. <laughs> said, we have to get him some, but without squeaks. I saw one the other day that was falling apart. I don't know if y'all knew that. He is so time. tired right now. It was completely collapsed. Yeah. Mm. We may have already thrown it out. He is fighting. He's sleepy. Mm -hmm. So I could tell my parents are retired because they had too much fun doing the triple wrap of boxes. This is a uh, Mike's been opening this present for three rounds this is so far. Light, so I'm pretty sure he's got more layers. <laughs> That's the third one, right? Yep, we're on the third layer. Oh no! Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> I'll just paint everybody. But I'm <laughs> I don't know, you're down to tissue paper now. Ah! Nope, still going. <laughs> we're not done. We're not done. <laughs> I'm ornament. Aw, cute. Very cute. Oh, Colby's like, can I eat it? It's an Amazon gift card. Packaged in this crazy way. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> well, asparagus is waiting to go in. The mac and cheese is in. It's almost time. Almost time for Christmas Eve dinner around here. Mm, we got mac and cheese straight from the oven. The ham. Looking good. So here's what we've got. We've got the cranberry relish. Ham. Asparagus. Mac and cheese. And then rolls on the table. Ash is ready to start. Give me a plate. <laughs> I heard that. <laughs> Tell him to go away for a minute. <laughs> He's hanging on your every yeah, word. You can lick a spoon. Does <laughs> it your mommy have to go to the bathroom or something? <laughs> Ash is hanging on your every word. We know which dog is her favorite, right? <laughs> they may have already gotten a little bit of ham, but. Uh huh. Yeah. yeah. We're cutting into the mistletoe cake now. We watched Jacqueline's Christmas Eve, well, their Christmas Eve, the 23rd vlog. Eve, Eve. Yes, Christmas Eve, Eve, and now it's time for mistletoe cake. Try it. And there it is, look how beautiful. It is so beautiful. Yeah. I love it. Well, the grandparents are packing up and Foster knows it and he's, he's gotten so sad. His mood entirely changed. He's like, wait, no, you don't need to leave. Everybody's making sad faces, I know. Grandma and Grandpa are leaving. <laughs> Poor Bean, I know, bud. He's like watching Grandma so intently, like, wait, no, I am sad. 
Well, Christmas round one is now over. My parents are heading home before it gets dark. And because the, the drive from here to my hometown is pretty much through the countryside of Florida. So you wanna make it home before dark to not like run into any deer or any creatures out there. We had a turkey that tried to fly in front of us one time with Mike and I. So they're headed home and we have a little bit of a lull. We're gonna go look at Christmas lights tonight because we saw the Sithmas area, but we wanna go see the rest of the Christmas lights tonight. So we're gonna do that later. But for now, I think it's time to do three of the advent calendars. We're gonna leave the tea for later. But now it is time for the final Burt's Bees, the final Harry Potter, and the final cheese, even though I'm way too full to eat it. So I kind of hope it is the truffle cheese because <laughs> I have no room for cheese, but ugh makes me sad. I've had an advent to look forward to every day since the 1st of November, basically, because, okay, so first day of Vlogmas, I told you I had another calendar that was supposed to be arriving. It still has not arrived. So if you wondered, whatever happened to that other advent calendar? Who knows? Who knows when it will get here? Um, hopefully it will get here eventually. Um, like I said, this is something that Sammy shipped for us from the UK and the shipping like tracking would have been an insane amount so we just don't know where it is if it's arriving when it will arrive anything so that advent calendar i don't know what i'm gonna do with it yet i don't know if i'm just gonna save it and use it next year we'll see but i had a different rituals calendar that was from last year that i was going to use originally and since i thought this other calendar was arriving for Vlogmas, I went ahead and used the previous one as a birthday countdown because my birthday is November 25th. So it works just like Christmas for an advent and I did an entire rituals advent to count down to my birthday. So I've had advents for two months now and I want advents every single month. <laughs> it's so fun to have something to look forward to every single morning, but I guess it wouldn't be special if we had it all the time, right? Anyway, I'm gonna stop stalling. Let's do Advents. Day 12, finishing the Burt's Bees. We have, ooh, yay, something exciting. Cranberry spritz, ooh. Okay, we definitely have to do a sniff test on this one. Ooh, yes. This one is super good. Big fan of this one. This will be, I think, once I'm done with the mint cocoa, I think I will use this one next because this is definitely something that will be a holiday flavor, but also like a January winter one. Love this one. Final thing for Harry Potter. And once I build it, I will show you, I'll get everybody arranged and show you the final setup we have. Everyone's a little knocked over at the moment. See what we have for the final day. It is... A snowman! Oh, this is so cute. Oh, I love it. So here is my finished display. I really enjoyed this. I would absolutely get a Lego calendar again. It was so fun to have a little something to build every single day. I love Legos. I'm not sure if I'd do the Harry Potter one. Again, I think they come out with a different one every year, but I would definitely be open to a Star Wars one, another Harry Potter one, who knows? Whatever they have available, I'm definitely open to it because this was a blast and so cute getting a little project every single day. So. This was a winner. And it's time to finish the cheese advent. I mean, we've had some good laughs over this one with our extra mature cheddar and aged Gouda. The spiced apple that was not what I was expecting it to be whatsoever. I don't think I'll get the Aldi one again next year. Maybe I can find something better. We'll see what flavors they include <laughs> for next year. But it is time for the final cheese. And we're all taking bets. Let me know what you think. What flavor is this gonna be? I'm betting it's a truffle cheese. The final day. What are you betting? I'm a truffle. All right, so we're both on truffle. I hope not. I hope I, hope I lose this bet. I'm kind of hoping it is truffle because I got no room for cheese anyway. So if it is, then just double truffle for you. 
trouble shoveling. Yeah. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Okay, there we go. There we go. The grand reveal. Ah, yep. I win. <laughs> because it's fancy. Yeah. So you gotta save it for Christmas Eve. Yeah. 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 No thanks. No to the fun guy. No to the fun guy. Nope. No cordyceps for me. All right, well, after two months, we finally get our space back in the fridge. That's the other, <laughs> the other catch about the Aldi calendar is that they release them like November 1st. So they sit in your fridge for two full months of having Aldi That's cheese. So, no, <laughs> we finally have space back. Bye Aldi cheese calendars. Oh, I realize I haven't done these advents. So let's do an orange here the 24th. Ah, oh, I can't believe tomorrow's Christmas. And there we are. So I have just been relaxing. Close the pantry door. That's not relaxing to me seeing that open in the background. I've just been relaxing for the afternoon catching up on Casey's vlogmas. I'm like caught up with everybody else. Um, I don't think Dan or Don or Dee have posted their vlogs for yesterday yet, but I'm actually all caught up on vlogmas except for Casey. I just watched her Disneyland one, which was really long. So I have three more vlogs of hers to watch. It's been so nice just to relax this afternoon. It's the, the first day I've really had a chance to I mean, obviously yesterday was relaxing too, but it was like relaxing with family. First day I've had a chance to just chill and it feels nice. I think I'm gonna enjoy this next week off a lot. Vlogmas is so much fun, but it just goes by in a whirlwind. And I think it's gonna be nice to have the week. I think I'm gonna have a little confusion of like, what do I do with my day? Uh, but I'm sure it's gonna fly by because I'm going to Arcadia and doing all that stuff. Mike's been taking a nap. I'm gonna wake him up pretty soon and then I'm going to put my pajamas on and I mean this already counts as basically pajamas because it's like a super it's my extra large bucky shirt so it's like super comfy cozy put on some pajama pants prep some sort of festive drink and we're gonna go look for Christmas lights I hear someone setting off Christmas fireworks <laughs> didn't know that was a thing uh, but someone is setting up fireworks somewhere. Uh, so hopefully the dogs aren't too disturbed. We're also gonna check the P.O. box while we're out to make sure we get any final Vlogmas cards. Two things. One, my stitch fix just arrived. Wasn't expecting that to arrive on Christmas Eve. So I guess I'm gonna have a Christmas present to open tomorrow. And that's gonna be my stitch fix. I'm just gonna leave it. I'm not gonna open it. I will save it for tomorrow. We'll do stitch fix tomorrow. Definitely. Wasn't expecting to have two stitch fixes during Vlogmas. I mean, I guess technically the first one arrived in November and I was just late to open it, but two, I just looked at the weather. It's supposed to be raining all day tomorrow. So that's gonna be Florida's version of like a snowy Christmas. We're just gonna be cloudy and raining all day. But I'm looking at the weather next week. And right now it's going to be highs in the 50s for Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And then Monday and Tuesday of next week, it's 61 and 62 for the high. So it's really not that much higher than the 50s. I am thrilled. We're gonna have like a solid five days of chilly weather for Florida. Like that's chilly, like lows in the, highs in the 50s, lows in the 40s, that's chilly. That's really exciting. So our new year, we're gonna have a chilly, chilly new year, kicking it off cold. Well, I've changed into my PJs, or what I'm calling my PJs for the purpose of this. Bumble shirt is back, PJ pants, and I've got my reindeer and Santa enjoying Florida turvis with some gingerbread coffee in it, because Starbucks is closed. You can't get Starbucks on Christmas Eve. So, sadly, but I do have the gingerbread iced coffee and it's time to go look for Christmas lights. Probably like the little snowmen all piled up together. Cute. Adorable. It looks great from the street. You can definitely. Ooh! 
scared me. <laughs> Bonus. <laughs> All right, they like Christmas here. <laughs> is that a is that a bumble up on the porch? There's a porch bumble. I think there's a porch bumble. There's a porch bumble. And a flamingo. Very Florida. Oh, I love the lights and the trees. It really, really nice. Very well done, but you got bumble, so you're immediately my favorite. Love ya. Good job. Even if they are infected. I got a little infection for bumble, but you know what? You still got a bumble, so you get a pass. You get a pass in my book. Let's find out. I'm not so sure it is. Dang. Well, need entrance, though. Very pretty. Look at all these palm trees. Very nice. Okay. 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 <laughs> okay. They went serious. That reindeer is as tall as their house. Okay. Yes. Now this is a winner. Look at that reindeer. Look at him. What's up? <laughs> that is an impressive inflatable. Hold on. I gotta get a picture of that. That's... Wow. Jeez. Oh no, the infection's spreading on both sides. Oh, oh no. That one's got it serious. Oh no. Serious case. Infection. Yep, looks like it. Oh, this one. Yes. This one is so good. They're all in the driveway. I love it. Oh, they've got liquor. <laughs> free cocoa. Well, we just got free hot cocoa from that house. That was awesome. <laughs> we drove by it last year, but they weren't, uh, we weren't here Christmas Eve last year. We did the 23rd last year, I think. That's so fun. Yep, there you go. It's very hot. Free hot cocoa. Entire neighborhood has the Lumieres out too. I forgot that from last year. I don't know if they did that last year. Oh, you know what? It was so windy when we were out last year. They probably didn't have them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they were flowing away. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Their garage is completely wrapped. Yep, I see that. They've got Snoop. They've got their own Snoop machine. Oh wow, yeah they do. <laughs> so good. Love it. They also gave us candy canes. <laughs> Come all ye faithful, joyful and triumphant. Come ye, come ye to Bethlehem. Come Oh, we found it. We have found the piece de resistance. <laughs> I mean, it's marked on the map, the Google Maps, so we figured it had to be good. I feel like you have to be a pretty extroverted family to add a walking display and <laughs> allow a bunch of strangers to walk through your driveway every year. Oh my gosh, I... He keeps going to the backyard. A 
A Christmas turtle? Oh my gosh. There's so much Christmas. It's a whole polar bear tree. Fresh popcorn? Absolutely. Yes, I will. Thank you. <laughs> Got our popcorn. Well, this is a new tradition. So, so cool. I'll put the information down in the description if you are local and you want to come check this out. We found it on Google. Literally, we see it on Google off of 75 whenever we're driving on 75. It says Riverview Drive light display or something like that. And so we finally came to check it out and so glad we did. It's amazing. Back home from the Christmas lights. And that means it's time to do the tea calendar. It's time for the final advent. Now, the good news is that whichever tea I don't drink tonight, I've got tomorrow. And we also nope. have. Well, but, but we have the other one because we didn't have Santa's Secret last That's night. That's true. So, I'm not sure what tonight's gonna be, but we can pick one, and then whichever one we don't have tonight, we can have tomorrow. So and there's the at least- The secret is safe for another day. Yes, the secret is safe, possibly, for another day. So that's exciting. So at least it's not like, this is the end, the end. But let's see what we have. Christmas Eve, day 24. All right, day 24. It's a big one. Not that it changed the size of the tea. It's a big box. Let's see. Drum roll, please. The final tea, the Christmas Eve tea is Sugar Pear Fairy. Sugar Pear Fairy. I'm, admittedly, I'm triggered by sh anything sugar plum. <laughs> right, after the Duncan. <laughs> yeah. well, let's see. Sugar Pear Fairy is apple. There's been a lot of apple. Apple, rosehip peel, pear, sweet blackberry leaf, elderberry, Bean peel, lemon balm, raisin, fig, rose petal, cinnamon, nutmeg. All right, I think I, I think I'm gonna do that one tonight and save Santa's secret for tomorrow. Santa can keep his secrets. It's safe for one more day until Christmas Day. <laughs> Your secret's safe without Santa until Christmas. So yeah, let's. Uh, oh, I didn't look at. Oh, that's Santa's secret. Wrong one. Let's see. 200 degrees for five plus minutes. <laughs> We've got quite the fireworks happening in the distance, but cheers to the sugar pear fairy. Skeptical. A little skeptical. A little skeptical. It's fine. It's not my favorite. It's not bad. Colby's mad at the fireworks. It's okay there. Mm. Yeah, it's fine. It's just kind of... I don't know. Apple and floral. Floral apple. Okay, like apple a little pear. pear. I get some pear. Floral. Yeah. Apple, pear, floral. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm going to drink it, but I'm much more excited for Santa's Secret tomorrow because I kind of already know Santa's secret because I read the back of the box, Whoa. so. <laughs> Spoilers. <That's rude. laughs> Spoilers. I mean, I'm keeping the secret, unless you watched yesterday's vlog, but. All right, I don't know if you can see behind me what's on the TV. It is time. It's Christmas Eve. That is love, actually. That is the mandatory watch. Oh. Netflix is trolling me. The timing, the timing Netflix. The TV just turned up. Oh, I went to screensaver. Wow. Mm -hmm. The timing of, I mean, and you the, guys saw the it. TV wants to block it. <laughs> hey Mike, I feel it in my fingers. Mm -hmm. I feel it in my toes. toes. Yeah. <laughs> if you really love, wait, no, I messed up the rhythm there. If you really love Christmas, Come on and let it snow. Oh, you see, you almost did show. You almost did show, but it's snow. Well, the original song. Well, that's what he does in the movie too. So, <laughs> it's time. It's the time is here. So I'm gonna go start it. It is also 11 o'clock, and I haven't started editing yet. So it's gonna be a late one, but it's Christmas Eve. Santa's just gonna come here on the later side because he was already here last night. So he knows our address. He knows where to find us. 
So, and he doesn't have that much to deliver here. It's really just stockings. How do you know that? Well, okay. I, I don't know. Maybe, maybe he'll surprise me. But you know, we're two adults. We don't there's need that much stuff. It's the kids that he's got to deliver. There's some stuff. But it's the kids he's got to deliver for. I. You talked to Santa? I got some advanced. You got, you got Santa secrets got without some, me? I got some advanced notice. The stocking may be stuffed. All right. Like stuffed. All right. Well, all right, Santa. And then, of course, we have a separate Santa. We have Santa Paws who also comes to our house. So it's a lot for tonight. Um, we're going to go start, Love Actually, with the tea and start editing. And Christmas Eve, it's done. It's crazy. Tomorrow is the final day of Vlogmas. But I keep saying that, but I think I'm going to do the bonus episode. So it's the final day of official Vlogmas. <sighs> Can't believe it. Let's get over there and start the best Christmas movie of all time. That's die hard. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sure there's people out there who agree with you, but. There are many people. <laughs> many guys out there who agree with you. <laughs> D, does Danny agree? Is that, is that his? Is die hard the number one Christmas movie? It's not my, it's not my number one Christmas movie. What's your number one Christmas movie? I don't know that it's really a Christmas movie, but Miracle is probably my. Hockey movie. I go think it is a go movie. figure. <laughs> all right, let's go. Well, we all do. That's why we're making the new version. Right. Okay. Let's go. I feel it in my fingers. In my fingers. I feel it in my toes. Tradition. I cannot believe this movie is 20 years old. This and Elf. I remember going to see this in the theaters in college. Uh, why? Christmas Eve is almost over, but I'm watching Love Actually, All is Right with the World. I'm gonna sign off the next to last day of Vlogmas. I will see you guys again tomorrow for Christmas Day. <laughs> so goodbye for now. I hope all of you had a wonderful Christmas Eve and I hope you have a wonderful Christmas. I will see you tomorrow. Yes, I would like that very much indeed. Bye.